but as a man it's kind of something that you gotta accept you know knowing that your baby isn't happy with you knowing that nothing you do in any aspect is good enough like you know you you broke that person entirely you just know that you're just not good for them I tried I tried to give a career I tried to give my love I try to give the good yin yang I try to give what I could give you know and I felt like it was me not giving in my all because that's one thing I I don't I don't think I'll ever be able to do if I don't feel like you're giving me your all I'll never give you my all but I'll try as hard as you want me to try you know but I won't give it my all I won't go beyond because I don't feel like that that same energy is being being returned so but you know I I tried you know I I tried and still I don't know it's just it it, it isn't good enough and you know you want to try for the kids and everything but I think I think he's old enough to kind of differentiate the two, you know, and he's not dumb, and, you know, if I went my own way, I'm sure that nothing would change, and that's all that should really matter to me, yeah, because I love her so much, it'll hurt once she moves on and everything, but I know she needs it, and she's just scared to admit it to herself, I think, but I see that that's what she needs, she just needs something new, fresh, and just something that actually picks her up off her feet, I no longer can do that, says that, you know, I still give the jitters and stuff like that but I doubt it it's just something that I feel like they have to say because because it's something that I feel like she has to say because I'm I'm her partner you know it's only right but kind of see right through it and I don't know but again I know I'm at fault for everything it's all the harm that I've caused that is just coming back all over again and then on her behalf the same tendencies from day one of our relationship which was caused because of me but you know I'm just I'm tired of going through the circle six years later I'm at the point in my life that I'm just trying to better myself I gave her the opportunity of being beside me to better ourselves together I tried that wasn't good enough so no, I'm just done you know there's no more that I could really do I, I feel like I I proved it to the as much as I could especially giving her you know an opportunity to to become a, a better person so you know with all that said I just I'm gonna just be me and just you know, live my life to the fullest because I realize that I'm just the happiest when I'm by myself. And that should sound sad, but I mean it in the best way possible. Happiest, but when I'm by myself, meaning I feel like I have nobody I got to answer to. I've always been that type of person. I hate answering to anybody. And, you know, I have no bad intentions, so I know all my intentions is good. And any 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 decision that I make... It's always to just benefit something. So I know I'm a good motivator to myself because nobody else could do it. You know, nobody else really understands me to the fullest. You know, she would be the closest to understand me to the fullest, but her judgment is clouded by the past. So she can't even see as far as I can see, I don't think when it comes to everything that's going on between me and her. And, um, yeah, I'm just going to live it to the fullest and make it as far as I could, just worry about my son. You know, her, yeah, like I said, it'll hurt once she moves on, same way it's going to hurt her once I move on. But, you know, I, I can't continue dealing with it. It's too much stress for what I got going on. And it's, it's unnecessary. It's just kid shit, to be honest. 
that I still deal with to this day. And if it hasn't changed now, I don't feel like it'll ever change. So maybe we need a couple years apart, be realistic. Maybe we'll never be together again. But the only thing I do know is that the friendship, that ain't never going to go. So if it's something that I guess I could cherish is that. And her being a mom to my son, I wouldn't take that shit back for the for nothing in the world because she's an amazing mom and yeah I mean that's all I really wanted to say just wanted to get that get that out there I'll probably continue up on it a little later because I don't feel like I I got everything out that I had to say but that's basically the basis of it alright so if I got something else to say I'll whip this out if I got something else to say I'll whip this out the phone not nothing else and um start recording if not then I catch up later